I'm up on the roof now and you can kind of see I've um, fastened the ladder to the um, the rail system that I've set up um, so what you're gonna do is you lean you lean over the um, the ladder to to, to 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 pull the panel off so I've found that it's better to put the the panel for me it's better to put it horizontal and it's a little more stable going up you need that kind of wider load and I think um, it's better so you just lean over so it's a little safer because you're never really leaning over you're just leaning over the ladder and then you just kind of sweep the panel to the side so you can kind of see my rig here I have several blocks these are from my sailboat some of them but you can buy them like for their pulleys some people call them pulleys there you can buy them for um, about you know five bucks um, and you don't need that big of a load so you see I've got like a five dollar variety right here this is the five dollar variety and these are the real expensive ones for my boat but anyway what happens is you gotta so the way to do it is run this line across your backyard don't wait to get to the top of the ladder to rig this you have a line here where all the blocks are attached to so just run it across your backyard the line and then have a line that basically um, that, that you take up to the roof and you haul this portion in place so you don't have to rig that on the ladder um, in advance and then what happens is when it gets up here make sure that these these things these lines are untwisted see like here's it here's a kind of an untwisted state but when you first get them up here they're going to be twisted so you just untwist them with their brothers down below their brother pulleys down below um, that's pretty much it this video i'm going to show you a little bit more about my ladder sled that enables me to hoist uh, modules up to the roof a 25 foot roof in this case using a Warner extension ladder that ex the extension ladder is not like the single ladder type of arrangement where you have one contiguous rail going up to the roof in this case you have two pieces of the ladder that are joined um, and they're joined um, right about there. Um, so we have a problem. I had to extend the rail there. Um, and then the sled arrangement, um, it doesn't have casters. However, the, there's plenty of casters designs on the internet. Um, I preferred this design because it was just a little simpler. And I didn't have to do as much engineering. This is one use. Um, so you'll notice there are control lines uh, attached to the um, attached here. I've I've got the um, I've also got a line that's rigged that I can easily. I have plenty of purchase. I have a hundred feet of line here for pulleys, and so it's it goes up pretty pretty well it goes up and down pretty well with not much effort which is kind of key if you're going to use a sled arrangement you need to have a lot of purchase um, the other thing is um, I have these control lines so I can hold a line and I can cause this to go up or down as you can see there's a couple of little there's a metal piece up there and then there's a transition. I'll hit it right about now. Let's see, I'm gonna hit it. See, I hit the transition. So, so what I need to do is have a way to jump those transitions or move laterally, just in case I get, in case I get caught. So here's this. This control too allows me to shift around see oops <laughs> but with weight it behaves a lot better the other thing is you want to try this out once you get this done you want to try it out with a 
not not a solar panel. I used a piece of plywood right here, which is approximate de the approximate dimensions of a, a solar uh, module. Um, so how did I put the track on? Um, I put the track on. I'm going to lower this so you can see too because I have a lot of purchase. So I need a down. I need the down um, pull on it because it's it's actually you need to assist it down when it doesn't have weight. So what I did was I went down to the hardware store and I got a some EMT um, strapping. So I was just able to strap this two by four. I I bought a two by twelve and just um, and I, two by four by twelve and just cut it in half, and that pretty much did what I needed. Um, the pulleys are um, put on with uh, just line, and um, what I did was I just tied bowlines around the blocks, and I did the same up there, um, and you kind of see that's what I did. I bought um, some, this, this was just a piece of EMT, I just led the line to keep it from drifting. And this was just a block uh, block that I mounted on the on a piece of 2x4. Up there, I pretty much did the same thing. I took a I took a here's line. a shot again of the uh, panel right up against the roof. Um, you can see I have those control lines, um, and they're really critical because. What happens is um, right there, um, they kind of the the little sleigh kind of hangs up, and then you can kind of see down there too the transition between the two by fours and the the ladder that hangs up. So you got to kind of anticipate where it's going to be hanging, and um, it it's nice to have the control lines on the bottom part and then the top, and it's kind of it's come in handy to really kind of lock down the the bottom of the panel because things kind of wave a little bit and then it's also nice to have that thing up on top you can kind of see I've got those um, I've got the little um, the little crawling uh, keepers but sometimes they don't keep as well as I'd, I'd like them to and you can kind of see up there the blocks I have um, I've got a bunch of blocks that are just put there and then um, the uh, the card itself has uh, some blocks up up high. You can kind of see. So um, anyway, that's my last panel. Hopefully, um, I won't have any more issues. Here's my first solar panel up on the roof. I really do need those blue lines uh, to uh, juggle the. Um, the hang-ups along the way. <laughs> like I said, it's not very pretty, but I think it works. I'll see how it works up on the top. Um, I'll let you know. Okay, here's the big day. I'm now bringing solar panels up on the roof, and uh, I kind of have a unique situation where I've got a two-story house, I've got an extension ladder, and you can see how it's going to be hard. It's hard to do a track. I've extended basically the extension ladder and made a, um, with that piece of wood, just extended a, a track of the extension ladder. And then I've got four purchases rigged. Um, and then uh, I'm basically going up to the very top and we'll see how it works. I've tested it with a piece of plywood over there but I don't really know how it's going to work out. We'll see.